kuongelea shenanigans zetu za tukiwa vijana wadogo na ukiona huyu kijana hapa kwa set you just know hakuna kitu ya adabu inaenda kuendelea hapa <laughs> wewe jua tu chome sana <laughs> wadau Philip Karanja kama ke wapinduru hizo <laughs> naziweka <laughs> Kabisa mimi so leo filo mazee nataka tupelekewa se eh, 2007 siku karibu kufe 2007 tukiwa pale Kenya Institute of Mass Communication so now 2007 ah. kulikuwa na kitu tunaita eh, annual stone throwing festival <laughs> between Kenya Institute of Mass Communication and the Kenya Polytechnic ambayo siku hizi inaitwa Technical University if I'm not wrong eh? yeah, yeah so Technical University hostel zao na shule yetu zime separatiwa tu na barabara. So unajua tu maze college mbili zikika within the same vicinity lazima kutakuwa na ngori maze. So hii usiku maze tume hata iko usiku ilikuwa mchana mchana tumekaa tu tumetulia watu wako kwa hostel wana bugudha wale wanasoma textbooks wanasoma textbooks wale wanasoma katiba wanasoma nini? Katiba. Katiba. <laughs> kidogo kidogo tunaanza kusikia tu. Uh, 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 uh. Ni nini hiyo maze? Kidogo kidogo wadau. Hua! Ukuta yetu yote chini. Vijana wa Kenya Polytechnic wameiangusha. Eh hey bro, hey. bro. Eh hey man. Nasikia nikaushaanza kusoma watu katiba na hatujawanzishia na referendum. Oh, poplay eh? Hey, eh, hey. poplay kidogo bana. My bad. Warudishe, hey. warudishe. Hey. So in 2007. In 2007. Back to 2006. Wait, wait. Wait, wait. Bus. Kenya Institute of Mass Communication Culture Week. Correct. Yes man, ile <laughs> kitu kuna culture week za other places than kuna the culture week. Yeah, the Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. Kabisa. Ah, yeah, yeah. Yo, so unajua I think who was the headline headlining act? Kwa Kolo. Yeah. Either Kolo or Makenzo. Sikumbuki. Yeah. Anyway, so Naam kumlipa wadau. Nini si wazuri? Nani? Si nyinyi mlikuwa organizers. So, check it. <laughs> Sisikiza <laughs> Yeah, so tume organize sherehe fiti sana mm. and so kulikuwa na rule yeah. ndio muingia pale hivyo Kenya cult, uh, kwa kwa festivities yeah. mnalipa pale kwa gate kulikuwa na entrance fee. Correct. Kawaida Kenya police wako pale kando. Yeah. Hawana form. Hawanaga. Hawanaga. Hawana form so waka decide form ni sisi. So wakakuja pale eh ase walikuwa marafians manze. Manze <laughs> walituvuruga pale kwa gate. Ikabidi ndo wameanza kulipisha nini entrance fee. Can you picture that? Mnaenda kwa college watu wengine, mnaanza kulipisha entrance fee mna pocket hiyo do. Bas. Na sasa ilibidi to behave jenye walikamo walipata off guard. Nasema sawa kule ni hiyo do. Lakini hiyo kitu ilituuma sana. Deadly. Ilituuma. In eh, fact, eh. after wamechukua pesa yetu ya entrance fee kwa gate, <laughs> wakaenda na wasichana wetu. Alafu wakati event inakaribia tu kuisha, <laughs> wakatupa tia gas kwa stage. Unakumbuka? <laughs> Wow 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 Danindo alikuwa judge uh, what her name Cecilia Karioki Cecilia Mwangi 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 former miss Kenya in fact na ali tulipata na yeye badala ya ambia after ngai after ukisanga zai enda ku officiate event nyingine ya kole ya kole wow wow walirushatia gas yeah wakatuzimia ngoma as in really na yeye mninga tuko nyumba ya mtu anyway so you can imagine vile tulikuwa tunasikia mazee yani after hiyo Ju Mose culture week meant everything to us. Yeah. Alafu nugu zinatoka huko zinakuja zinaharibu. Ikakuwa haidhuru haina mambo. So si waga tu tumekaa tumetulia. Kitu ikawadanganya 2007. Wakatoka huko na maulevi zao, wakakuja wakaanza kurusha wapi? Mayo wapi? Kwa mabati yetu. Mm-hmm. Nakumbuka. Yeah. Kumbe kitu sisi wenye tulikuwa pale wasa na tukujua ni wakati mawe zilirushwa kwa mabati vijana walikasirika wakatoka wakasema this is it leo ndio hiyo siku so walienda wakaingia poli wakavuruga alafu wakatoka ndio poli sasa wakaenda wakapiga reinforcement wakakam wakaangusha nini ukuta sasa ikakuwa ni a full fledged war tuko pale mazema generali commander tuko nini philip karanja pale anaongoza battalion hey, kitu ikamdanganya <laughs> Kitu ikaambia filo <laughs> hii vita hatuwezi ishindia kwetu ndio to defend the territory we must take the war to them Kabisa. so philip wakashikana na kikosi fulani wakaenda mpaka kwa geti ya Kenya Polite- Polytechnic what happened <laughs> <laughs> 
Buda, hata ni me Udaja manze last episode niliangusha gangster points yeah. Niambe watu niliziko jole ya kidogo Bazi Cheki muonga, muonga gangster, muonga warrior yeah. So, ay, vita imeka Hiko yeah. nini, tuende mbele Na yo na ah, na, eh, Buda na kiliwa peleka Mawe, mawe, mawe Paka sasa tumenda kwa territory yao So tumefika kwa gate yeah. Yeah, yeah, Gate yao ya yeah. uh, hostel zao Correct Bro Mimi nilikuwa Daudi na ile ilikuwa Goliath. Lazima ningewaangusha. Mimi mawe zangu zilikuwa zina hii. Zinafika kufika. Yeah, so niko hapo hivyo kwa gate. Sasa nina shida moja. Yeah. Muanga lefty. Kuisha. I'm left handed. But sasa ile position nimezi set. Yeah. Kwa launch ingekuwa poor launch mawe na right. Na right. Sasa hapo ndio ngori iliingia. Juu sasa ah. ndio ni launch fit iko yeah. na effect. Sasa nimechukua ile mawe nataka sasa goal ya thadunde. Yeah. Sasa lazima nirudi nyuma yeah. nizi set. Ndio. Ha. Bro, nilinua hivi nilipata. <laughs> Buda, hata yeah, kabla tu ufike hapo. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Ndio sasa wewe urushe mawe fit lazima uji expose. Eh, eh. Ndio sasa upate position fit. Eh. Sasa wakati wewe unapiga hiyo hesabu. Eh. Mimi nimesimama si ukuta imeangushwa eh. pale kwetu KMC. Yes. Mimi sita wadanganya, sina hiyo nini ya kuenda mpaka Kenya Poli. Mimi nilikaa kwa fence yetu. Mimi na defend pande yetu. <laughs> so, mali ukuta imeangushwa so unajua ukuta inakuwa gani ukuta pila yeah. ukuta pila hizo si ndizo support yeah. ukuta yeah. so ukuta imedundishwa imebakisha pila hapa katikati mimi nimesimama hapo nimejisupport na nini na pila <laughs> niki try kuchungulia hivi maze nasikia <laughs> hiyo si nyonde si nyo hiyo vile inakuja <laughs> man ilichapa hiyo pila mawe ushaona mawe ina disintegrate ina kuunga mawe ina yani ikaisha nikashindwa hiyo ni nini kuchungulia hivi chini naona mazee kuna nugu pale Kenya Poli iko na slim kazi tu ni hiki tu hiki tu anapima tu akiona mtu ayuko rada huwa nayo nayo sasa hiyo ndio kitu Philip Karanja hakuwa ameona pale malifilo alikuwa amesimama akitrai kutafuta position nini nini umse alikuwa shamuona anajua ndio huyo filo so ndio arushe mawe lazima atoke nje Haya. <laughs> Buda. Ulisikia hata hiyo sauti? Eh hey, mimi ndio nanga too black. In fact I think to date yeah. fe- face yangu is side wanga bado haijarudi. <laughs> haijarudi fit. Eh hey, gigongo asome hapa manzi siezi toy kofia na kakibaki. <laughs> uh, corona times atuwezi enda kunyoa manzi. <laughs> Sasa <laughs> mbaya. <laughs> so let's imagine the situation ndio hiyo kidogo mse wenu wako chini man down man down philip ako pale ameanguka behind enemy lines lazima mumtoe otherwise atauliwa huko sasa ni kusukuma rescue team waende waweke kijana kwa machela kwa stretch atolewe hapo teke teke mpaka wapi ulipelekwa hospital au ulipelekwa hostel uliye na ulipelekwa hospital kulikuwa na school na sepik yes. kwa first aid before to end hospital before mwingi hospitali yeah, sasa yeah. Although it like to say it's kumbuka ng exact details but na nakumbuka hosi na kumbuka sana hiyo didi this can kill a hosi yeah. sasa buda after ugongwe na hiyo stone ili ili chocha wa se design nyingine watu walikamwa kakuwa waka, any will go to hewa <laughs> na kwambia umati ili toka kmc design ya 300 unakushiki <laughs> bila wale mafoses wa 300 utoka wakaingia Kenya Poli wakasukuma hiyo mbogi wakamaliza mm-hmm. watu walirudishwa mpaka kwa hostel yes. ndani huko general 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 alikuwa ame alikuwa amewatota maze then after hapo maze i think kuna msali alikol makarao but kuna kitu moja sita isahau maze ni ile ile kujituma wasichana wa KMC walikuwa wamejituma oh. unajua by the hakuna wanaume alikuwa anatoka position yake kutafuta mawe ah. Madem walienda wakachukua makarai wakaeka mawe ndani au na wanapita katikati ya faya za penda wasi wa chikilena ako pale ako hapa nyuma atari huyu ni general huyu lena lazima niweke katawe yako hapa by the way lazima jo so kidogo kidogo maze GSU ndio hao wameniniwa unfortunately wale madem wetu maze wa brave hiyo time ya kokota mawe hao ndio walipata maze the brand force of the general service unit Man. walikula marungu mbaya sana yeah. mbaya sana lakini despite hizo marungu bro 
Kenya Poly mpaka leo <laughs> hawajawahi hawajai rusha mawe kwa mabati sichokoze <laughs> 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 police station <laughs> <laughs> rusha mawe kwa police station mtu <laughs> ambao <laughs> jo but maze eh hey, buda ungeenda hiyo siku buda <laughs> the worst bit sasa ni I think it, it was on a Friday. It was on a Friday, I remember. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. On Monday. Yeah. Man, they're gonna shoot. Cinema superstar ka ka hii hai. Eh, sasa kwanza ufala ni nilikuwa ni share shoot like half an episode. Correct. Eh, uh, so episode kian this is kumkani episode gan but yeah. I think was like in view sasa on the check yeah. Like season 4 or 5 yeah. or 6, I'm not sure. Yeah. So episode kianza half of the episode diko fit. Maze. The other half man, ni na bandage na tosha. <laughs> So na imagine your conversation a producer <laughs> like if you was a filo unaga but ah what and kushongori zangu zote uanza na Abel Mutua <laughs> case in point hiyo siku ya vita ya ya hiyo siku ya vita yeah. mimi ni medoz yeah. nasikia mawe kwa mabati nasikia ukuta imeanguka correct nilisikia hivi nafungua hivi macho buda uko kwa bed so, o- automatically nilijua hiyo ni ngori na Abel ako in the mid songs out to wanza na eh that is jungle mbona na kufuatanga ah usiani yani <laughs> in your relationship sasa this is it <laughs> ila goga through thick and thin ah but maze ilikuwa ilikuwa siku na nusu maze yeah na hivyo ndio tuli survive bana maze young and stupid yeah, i know i know sasa hii maze ngori ikiwa hapa unaenda huko by the way acha tu nikwambie mapevu ukajipata kwa ngori tena juu uko peke yako niko sole skufi tena <laughs> Wada mzee tutazidi jo bofi ya hiyo button ya subscribe mm-hmm. hapo episode 7 iko jikoni na pako pako mafuta na actually tuko na huyu mtu yani wewe hey filo bro lakini mzee uda nichomea cv unajua mtani watu jua mimi ni msanii umetulia hey, basi waambie wasi subscribe <laughs> tutazidi wada mzee all the best mzee tuone next week au sio <laughs> wazi wazi <laughs> yes